when you bury somebody, uh, there's a little cemetery by the place we have at the Lake of the Ozarks, and that little cemetery, those people, most of them were buried in the late 1800s and early 1900s, and there are trees growing over where they were buried, and they became the food for the trees, which became the food for the birds and other animals, and, and there's nothing left underneath there. Maybe some bones, maybe, maybe not even that, and yet we believe they're resurrected and with Christ. And so uh, today, in a world in which there's not enough land in a lot of places for, uh, for burials, and when we think about, uh, you know, some of us think about, I don't really, I, I, we started a church in a funeral home. I don't really want to go through what they do at the funeral home to prepare people for burial. I'm just okay with being taken at my little niche in the Memorial Garden here somewhere. And so, uh, no, from my personal perspective, the idea of cremation does not in any way inhibit your resurrection from the dead.